about to venture into our annual London trip. We go down onto the Thames every year. This is the third year we've done it. In fact, this is the bank holiday long weekend and three years ago, this weekend, we moved on to Bora. So it's really nice actually that we're here in Limehouse about to go through the lock this afternoon and onto the Thames for our trip. Um, and all the way to Kingston this time for a Dutch barge rally, which is great. Um, but we've just done the big trip down from Broxbourne all the way to Hackney and then we've come from Hackney to Limehouse just for the night. That trip is such a long trip and we enlisted a couple of trainee crew to come on board and help us out to get down just with Ollie and all those locks, 10 locks, it takes 10 hours at least. Um, on a good day so uh, yeah it's really hard work just the two of us and now with Ollie um, just makes for a, a nicer time having some extra hands on deck literally learning the ropes so massive thank you to Prue and Kitty for coming on board um, they were boating they were camera crew they were amazing and we're very grateful that they came along with us that day um, going to come back today as well go out on the Thames with us as a little treat which will be nice too but um, yeah for now just going to enjoy Limehouse for a few more hours so we've been up around here this is Ware and Hartford uh, and we've come all the way down from around here Broxbourne all the way down the River Lee, and we're at Limehouse at the moment down here. We're about to go on to the Thames. Yeah. Chiswick is sort of in here. Um, so all the way to Le West London. But this is those ten locks. Quite a long day. You have to tell everybody, it's moving day, Ollie. Is it exciting? Yay! It's exciting! So here we are. House duties. Dishes. So, what are we doing, Kitty? We're going to London. Going to London? Where are we? Um, in <laughs> Broxbourne. No We're in Broxbourne, <laughs> yeah. We've got a long day. And uh, what's the weather like? Sprinkling, it's cold outside. But um, we made it under the bridge. So exciting, I'm worried about that. <laughs> Classic. So it's really hard to. I didn't realise you had to manually open the lock. Yeah. Well, well, yeah, out here you do. Once we're in London, there's a few more uh, key operated ones, like actual keys. But ah, okay. okay. Yeah, out here it's all uh, hard labour, baby. Yeah, it's proper. I can, I can see why you got me on board. <laughs> yeah. Check out those guns. Check out those guns, right? <laughs> Smug out. <laughs> Here we go, another lock. How wet are your pants right now? <laughs> Yay!
Give us a smile then. So Borrow's got to go down. So it's a fairly okay. big drop this one. How are we feeling? Yeah, lock, lock number 10. Yeah. Yeah. I think we've had to reverse about seven or eight of them. Most of them, yeah. Yeah. But this is the end. We're done for today. Well, we need to more up, but we've done with lock. I feel like I've put in a good training day. Yeah. <laughs> I think I started the day feeling like a 9 out of 10. Yeah. I'm um, probably like a 6. Kitty started or a 7 11 out of 10, and she's downstairs couldn't give a shit now. Yeah. <laughs> It's, it's good. Yeah, she's I on think, baby duty. She's on baby duty. Baby duty. I, I think normally I finish these days at about a three yeah. or a two. Yeah. So six or seven is pretty good. I feel productive. Yeah. yeah. What, out of ten? Um, probably about a four. Four. <laughs> <laughs> I managed to lose the count. If I had to do one more lock, I probably could, but well, I think I'll be looking for the tube home. Yeah. 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 yeah, it hasn't been a great day. We. What happened? But first I lost the ring. Yeah, the, the little steel thing that holds us I in. I just smacked it with the mallet into the river. And it fell, yeah. And then um, let the cat out, so we had to, we got stuck for 40 minutes, of, like an hour. Jerry went walking about. Yeah, and, uh, yeah. And then, the <laughs> had a bit of guitar session then, and a cup of tea then. A bit of a guitar session, but then <laughs> we had to cut the rope and bore it dropped like two metres, because mm. I tied it wrong around the cleat. Yeah, we got hung on one of the, the locks with the rope jamming itself, yeah. and so we had to cut it. Um, so I'm looking like a massive professional to me. This trip's always adventurous. It's, we haven't had anything around the prop yet, though. Yeah, well, that's the next <laughs> That's That normally happens. Normally happens now. I'm okay with this. This is pretty good. We're in London. Is it um, worth that horrible all day trek with 10 locks and tired and cranky? Almost worth it. Honestly, today maybe, yeah. <laughs> today we got to do whatever we wanted. And Jerry's liking it. <laughs> um, yeah, just be done the street. There's like loads of organic shops. I like this place. Okay, well, yeah. There's loads and loads of bins for all yeah. of our rubbish <laughs> and all recycling. The recycling. All the recycling you could ever want. It sounds really stupid, but it's like, what a delight. <laughs> it's really hard to find anywhere else, but now that we're in civilization, it's everywhere. Um, yeah, we've just been down, had a picnic in the park after buying a falafel wrap from some market vendor for coffee. And the sun's out. Life's pretty good. Life's pretty good. I'm okay with this. And not only is the wildlife just as lovely down this part of the world. Uh, who are you talking to? One of the <laughs> other great advantages of being close to London is being closer to some of my very lovely friends and family, <laughs> especially my brother Cam. Hey Cam! Hey! So, we've <laughs> finally got this parcel here. Here you go. Auntie Gemma has sent it all the way from Australia. It's been sent to Cam. Never trust Royal Mail ever again with anything. <laughs> Took me at least a month to get it from the delivery company. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. They couldn't work out where my address was, but they could send me a mail to tell me they couldn't find me. <laughs> that makes no sense. Yeah. But it's here, and uh, we can finally try Ollie on some reusable nappies. He's stoked. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Look, Ollie. You know, open it up. Ooh. 
Yeah, these are the old ones, hey? The ones we have to throw out all the time, lots of waste. Ooh, Ollie, look. What colours do you like? Good. Now we just need the batteries to work so I can do all that washing. <laughs> One size for all the butts in the world. Thanks for tuning in to Five Knots Cruising. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like as it really helps us to get our video out to more viewers. And we'd love to hear your feedback, questions and ideas, so please drop us a line either on our Instagram page or YouTube channel.